it's the next day. Um, you know, guess what? My Insta got cancelled last night. I've never had that before. I've rebooked it for this morning. It's coming now. Um, I'm knackered. I'm so tired. But I'm going to get up for Asda. Oh, God. Yeah, it said something along the lines. Oh, let me. It just said order cancelled. And then it said, sorry, order cancelled. <laughs> We hate to let anyone down and only cancel when we have no choice. For example, due to severe weather or bad traffic. Like, I've never had that before. Yeah, so I don't know what happened. Because it weren't bad weather. And so I don't know if there were an accident somewhere or I don't know. Yeah, it's saying it's uh, a couple of stops away. So I want to grab a coffee and um, wait for my Asda. Blake's still in bed, Corbin's still in bed. David woke up and out at like half five this morning because he, um, he had, he's he got a job on but not with work, it's his day off work and he's uh, doing some work with his friend today. So, he's in Birmingham. As has been, I asked him about last night, I said I ordered this last night and it had been cancelled and stuff and he said like, that's weird, he was working last night and I said time and he said, you know, that, that, it should have come. Uh, he said there was a weather warning, so whether they took that into account, I don't know. It, there were no severe weather. But anyway, I'm happier because I only got two subs. I had six last night, so that's better. Um, I got some ready meals. So I just got, I think you got one, two, you got four. Four for six pound, I think. So I got spaghetti and meatballs, spaghetti bolognese, a chicken chow mein, and a chicken tikka masala. It's just always handy to have in. And then some chicken burgers. I'll be honest, most of this, it's only a very small shop and it was just a top up of fruit and then we'd totally run out of crisps, chocolate and sweets. We had, like, we've got none. Um, so I just topped that up, I've got a few extra bits, I think it came to about 60 something, 64 and then about 68 with delivery. But these were on offer, they were reduced, I can't remember what, but I think they were meant to be 3 £4 on them with £2 something. I got them. I've got the camera, the camera's on face track, so it's tracking the work. Um, I've just got one rice, we've already got a couple in the cupboard. Two packs of chocolate digestive biscuits, as does ones, they're about 80 odd p and they're just as good as the McVitties. Scotch eggs, I've just remembered, I've not got, when I don't have my microphone on, I've said this before with this camera, when I'm talking and doing this, it distorts my voice, it's really weird, hang on. Right, I'm just going to wear this because I know it'll not distort my voice. Uh, some mushrooms, grapes, a pack of Kit Kats, told you it were rubbish, <laughs> buttons, twirls, whispers and crunches. This will see us through now um, until we next need an order. I mean chocolate and sweet wise, not other food wise. Um, two of these strawberry tubes. My muesli, I'm gonna have this for my breakfast in a minute. I absolutely love this stuff. Eggs, uh, two packs of ham. Yeah, two for three pound. Double cream Oreo. This was a sub. I ordered the milk loaf, cause Blake loves that uh, milk loaf, you know, the round. But they sent this instead, Danish. Two packs of rainbow drops. Oh no, my raspberries have squashed. Raspberries and strawberries. Some bourbons, four of them. Palm of violets. Lettuce. Some of these tea cakes. This was another sub. I just got the normal green sour patch. Um, yeah. Corb don't like these, but Blake will eat them, I think. Cucumber. And then just a couple of bits on the back here. So I've got two packs of crisps, Seabrooks and french fries and then some milk and the multigrain 
shapes. And that's everything. So I'm gonna go put this away for breakfast because I am hungry. Me and Blake have just been playing um, all the games. So we've got the PlayStation out, the PlayStation 5, and then we've got the Xbox One X or something, Xbox One I think it is there. And then we've also got a PlayStation 3. So yeah, we found these out and we've just been playing some games through the discs for a couple of hours this morning, just to pass some time, you know, because we can't go on to any other games. I've got it, I don't want to play Fortnite. But anyway, this is the sofa. I've still got the box there. I need to break that up um, and try and put it. It's recycle day tomorrow. But this is the sofa. I'm going to get a couple of cushions to put here, like grey and navy blue, and then maybe a throw to put there. This also goes down into a um, a bed. So you basically, can't do it right now, but you, you bring this bit forward. It's on like a latch and then it latches and then this bit here just goes flat. So then the whole thing is flat. Yeah, and it turns into a bed. And it turns into a bed, which is really cool just in case. I mean, you never know when you need that bit of extra space. It were only, I think it were 189 on Amazon and yeah we just thought it'll it'll put us on for now it's giving what's it giving waiting room <laughs> waiting room vibes but I'm thinking with a couple of cushions and then I'm gonna bring like that granddad chair in once I've got the cover over it yeah I think it'll look quite nice this is my mum's rocking chair I'm gonna see if I can uh, borrow it for a bit until we get another chair so then we've got this whoa so then we've got like the three seater and then we'll have the rocking chair and the other chair. And then here, I'm gonna, um, they need to go upstairs. David brought that <laughs> from the storage yesterday. I'm gonna bring the gray chair in from the kitchen to have here as well. So there'll be plenty of places to sit once we're sorted. He also brought this, I don't know what we're doing with this. What else did he bring? He brought these couple of stools and oh, our bedside, our bedside tables are upstairs. But yeah, let's um, we'll get there. The we need to take them upstairs so they're out the way. But I really have no idea where I'm gonna put them. And then this, I'll bring it back in a short while. I'm going to put together one of these i'm going to do it in the girls room because now the girls room has more space than any other room so yeah i'm going to put it together soon just to see how easy it is we've all got one so you can see what it's all about because it, they were only 13.99 each so i'm not expecting much but the reviews were actually quite good i really wish they were a setting to keep this gimbal still uh there is three settings with the gimbal on this camera but none of them actually makes it like not move at all and it, it's just annoying because it just takes off everywhere and I think I'm filming something and it's filming the ceiling or oh, floor you know it's it's not the easiest that's the only two complaints about this camera is when I haven't got my mic on and I'm rustling something it distorts my voice and then there isn't a setting to keep the gimbal, the camera gimbal, completely still so it just can't move at all. Even on the setting where it's meant to be a lot easier and not do that, it's still fucking, it's still all over the place. It's the DJI Pocket 3, just in case you were wondering. And apart from them two things, it's amazing, I absolutely love it. Here we go. I've just got them all in grey, you can get them in all them different colours there. I just thought that just goes with everything, I don't know. We can't decorate or do anything for a year. I hope they're easy to do, I've got seven of them. So we've got lots of them. Some poles. Canvas bits. More canvas bits. Oh, 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 oh my god. 
I literally think this is the instructions. Let me show you. That. That's the wardrobe and that's... Oh dear. Okay. I don't understand. I don't understand. I can't do it. It's not clear, like... This bit is not clear, like... Down here. I don't know what them two are, what size they are, it doesn't say. I don't know, I think I'm going to have to have some dinner and then come back. I've just looked on Amazon to see if they had any better instructions on Amazon. I'm actually going to YouTube it to see if anybody's put it on YouTube. But, um, they've gone up to 19.99. There was, um, look at my hair, I need to wash it tonight. It was, uh, I paid £13.99. I'm not getting nowhere today at all. Well, I need food now. I can't concentrate when I'm hungry. I think we're going to paint the stairs. Because these are pretty good stairs. Give them a really good clean. And paint them. And then put a piece of the carpet that you can stick. I don't want to do that. Oh, God. I can't take myself seriously. I'm also going to paint this because this has got sentimental value. Um, I need to get all these stickers off what, the, <laughs> what Blake's put on. But yeah, it's sentimental. I got it from my nana's, um, along with the chair. And all the grandkids growing up, they used to always put the fingers through it, even down like Kira and Abby, my older two when they were little. And then uh, my dad or my nana used to like, from the top end, like get the finger like that. Yeah, so I got that, but I think I'm gonna spray paint it or paint it. So it, cause I've got nothing else black, so it doesn't go. And then I could top, um, spruce this table up as well while we're at it. I've had a good old ready meal and now I'm back. <laughs> Trying to do this wardrobe. Nothing on YouTube or anything for this particular one. Um, oh god, I can't wait to wash my hair tonight. Yeah, there's nothing. So I'm just going to have to wing it. I need to remember, Blake's got rugby tonight. So I need to remember to get ready. Wow. This has taken some doing. There's a the frame. Um, my hands are filthy. Look. That is actually disgusting. Uh, <laughs> now I just need to put the cover on which is here and it should look like this that were a joke with them instructions now I know what I'm doing it should be okay but my hands are killing and why is it so filthy right so I'll put that on I'll be honest it's not really that steady look but to be fair for 13 99 what I got it for you know it'll be all right it'll be all right for the kids clothes I'm not sure about mine you won't be able to hang any heavy heavy coats or anything on it and there we go with it on and then this and then you can fold it up there then that rolls up you can obviously do it neater and then this one rolls up the same too up there only problem is you can only it's only this bit here and that bit there like all the back you'd think there'd be another bit there that you could tie and either end but there isn't it's just the front ones which is a bit weird but it'll do so there both of them and then there is here a rail where you hang your clothes i've uh, i've taken pictures as well to where these all go because that was a confusing bit down at the bottom here there were different and the instructions and the same on this bit here. Um, but we got there in the end. Once I started putting it together, it started to make sense. Anyway, I best get everybody for rugby.